Dana joins us on how they work. Hi, good morning, guys. Okay, if you've never seen a rail bike before, they are actually so cool, and I think it's one of the coolest ways to get around if you can manage to get on one. So hopefully, as soon as all this quarantine is over, we'll be able to do that. But I do want to introduce to you this morning Rob Peterson, who is the general manager of the Sac River Train. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning, Dina. Good morning. Okay, so rail bikes. This is new for our area. So exactly what are they, and, and what can you do while you're on the rail? Well, it's a two-person uh, bike with four wheels. It's uh, got an electric-assisted motor, and you share the same railway as the Sacramento River train. That is so cool. Okay, so our photographer, Scott Zetner, is there showing us. So how long is a ride? Who can do it? What age group are you talking about? Yeah, uh, children that are at least six years old can ride with a parent, you know, or a guardian. Mm -hmm. uh, if you're 13 or older, you're able to ride a rail bike by, either by yourself or with a friend or family member. Uh, the ride consists of about 14 miles on the railways, and it'll take about 90 minutes, maybe a little more, to go down to West Sac and then return to the train station. Okay, so I have to ask, how do you know that the timing is going to work right with the train, right? Because you're on the existing rail line. Yeah, we're on. Well, we're a privately owned, isolated railway, and so we 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 control all the equipment. The the Sacramento River train generally is going to run in the evenings, and the rail bikes will run all day long. So, so they'll have day excursions, and then we'll get off the rails and, and make way for the train. I Hold love this. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, so I know with everything going on right now, obviously you have to kind of wait for some of these shelter at home or shelter at home orders to be lifted. So, what's the plan there in Yolo County for you guys as a business? The current uh, orders are through May thirty first. Um, so, you know, with everything going right, we'd love to be open with these rail bikes on June first. So we just we you know we just got to follow all the regulations. Okay, by June first. Well, you know, as soon as that's uh, something that we are able to do, I'm going to get out there in person and get on one of these things because I think they look so fun. Uh, how can people start looking into this if they want to reserve a spot? Obviously, when everything opens back up, where do they have to go? Well, we've opened up a web page at sacrailbikes.com, and so that'll take you to the web page, and you can actually start buying uh, gift certificates or making reservations for the future. Okay, very cool. Thank you so much, Rob Peterson, again joining us this morning from Yolo County, the Sack Rail Bikes coming to the rail yards near our station, friends, at Good Day. So I am actually thinking Good Day Challenge in yeah. our future. Oh, yes. <laughs> that was cool. All right, thanks, Dana. All right, thanks.